Hi, another one of those monsters. This is Naja Melanoruka, the forest cobra again. And this is about the fourth or fifth big one that we've had this year. Now believe it or not, this place where we are now is a golf course. You might be able to hear the grass cutting machines in the background. And it's a bit grumpy, like a bullfight going on here. Just wait for it to calm down a bit. Marja Melano Luca. This one's about <laughs> about 2.6 meters. Pretty big fella. Quite strong as well. As you can see, I have to dance a bit to stay out of its way. Stay there. Naja Melano Luca. Africa's longest cobra. This one's still probably got about 50 centimeters to a meter to grow. But it's quite a big old one. And I suspect from reports that this one has been here for a while living in this area. It stands nice and high. There you are. Isn't that beautiful? Very majestic snake. I always compare this snake to the king cobra of Asia and indeed it's only second in size to the king cobra of Asia. Not quite as big as a black mamba but very very large for a cobra. It's a strong snake, it's an agile snake and uh, these types of snakes they are territorial, they'll live in one area for a long long time. They'll cover a, an area of a few square kilometers and they will always come back to the same lair where they will remain for years until they disturbed. Now this one's obviously making the golfers nervous, been seen many times, so we'll take it away and release it somewhere in the bush. Let's see if I can get it to turn around so you can see. There you are. See, it stands a good 7, 60, 70 centimeters high, which is approximately correct. They'll stand about a third of their own body length. That's the height. Now, the interesting thing is, yes, they can still move forward in terms of lunging, but it can only actually strike for the distance of the height at which it is standing. They've made by a mistake. This is a very dangerous snake. It's got a largely cytotoxic venom like the adders and vipers with strong neurotoxic components. And this a snake like this would kill one of us as quickly as a black mamba would. But nevertheless, as you can see, very, very majestic snake. Stay there. That's it. Just watching. See, it's watching the movement of the cameraman. Thank you. Watching the movement of the cameraman, very alert, and as snakes go, these ones have pretty good eyesight. See if I can capture it and put it in the box now. Bear in mind, kids, don't try this at home. This is an exceedingly dangerous snake. And please note, 
I take the relevant safety precautions. in a box now and we're going to release it in a place where both snake and humans are safe. <laughs> 